This is another real case history of a real copy strategy. It too is a good copy strategy. It too is short, clear, competitive and focused. It fits nicely into our template. This one built the value of a brand for its owner, P&G, in 1970 Spain. As the most expensive laundry detergent on the market at the time, Ariel might have faced an impossible task in trying to move from number 8 in the highly competitive detergent market to market leadership. But carrying a 40% price premium over its nearest competitors in a market of relatively poor 1970s householders, that is exactly what Ariel did between 1971 and 1976. At no time in six years did Ariel change its product. At no time did it cut its price or discount. The growth in sales, profits and brand value came solely from a good copy strategy and the communication of brand advantages to the consumer that flowed from that strategy. How do I know all this? Well, I was managing the Ariel brand for every minute of those six years, and I know how it was done. It was done with copy. Ariel's communication strategy targeted all housewives. A descriptor which was not at that time gender-specific, guys were deemed capable of washing clothes even in 20th century Spain. Ariel was to be positioned to consumers as the best detergent brand. So, to the Ariel copy strategy. Just to remind ourselves of our template, Brand X copy will convince customers Y that Brand X offers unique, functional and or emotional benefits Z and will thereby satisfy their needs better than any competitor. And the requisites? A good copy strategy is clear, brief, overtly competitive and focused. For Ariel, we wrote a copy strategy as follows. Ariel copy will convince all housewives that Ariel offers the benefit of noticeably whiter garments than can be achieved by using any competing brand. Discriminating housewives can see the whiteness difference and in time can be expected to become loyal Ariel users. This copy strategy was short, clear, competitive and focused. It fitted nicely into our template. A good copy strategy helps creatives to write effective copy and develop an effective ad. Ariel's communication, without fail, showed perceptive housewives recognizing the superior whiteness on packaging, promotional material, radio, TV, billboards and in print. Most fabrics at that time were white and Ariel's superior performance was most visible on white fabrics. Over six years, Ariel achieved clear market leadership in Spain and those sustained profits which deliver brand value to the owner. The copy strategy remained unchanged. Of course, an effective copy strategy does not create loyalty on its own. Product itself has a critical part to play, but nothing plays a greater part in building brand value than good, effective communication derived from a good, effective copy strategy. We'll look at one more winning copy strategy in the next class. Join us.